lahat ng may gawain mula sa pinag-influence, sa pinag-influence, sa mga bata, sa pag-influence. The greatest tragedy in life is not death. Ang pinakamalaking trahedya po sa buhay ay hindi kamatayan. But it is a life without a purpose. A life with the wrong priorities. to become a servant, he becomes ano po? A servant. Yan yung laging pakilala ni Apostle Paul. Workers are few. Don't look at yourselves. Look at the one who created the harvest. May gagawin ng Diyos. May kilos ang Diyos sa lugar na to. May gagawin ng Diyos sa pamilya mo. May gagawin ng Diyos sa'yo. The Lord may be starting small. But that's not the end of it. The Lord will do great things in your life. Handa ka bang sumuko sa Kanya ngayon? The Lord is calling you to action. The Lord is calling you to compassion. The Lord is calling you to His vision. And the Lord is calling you to pray for His intercession. Will you heed the call for heaven? Today is the time. Mahal nandito ka ngayon. 
mga kaibigan. Hindi ko po alam yung mga bagay na pinagdadaanan niya. I'm just so glad that I'm here and you're like family to me agad. But if you are here today, can't destroy you, you will discourage you. Maybe discourage ka kayo and you are saying, alright, so, sama mo ako sa prayer. Naniniwala naman ako kay Lord. Pero para sa hindi makita natin sila bilang mga tao na nangilangin sa iyo, yung Panginoong Jesus, that without you, Jesus, Lord, walang direksyon, walang purpose ang aming buhay. Tulungan mo po kami, Panginoon, na maramdaman ang mga nararamdaman mo sa mga tao ito.